vintage vault. We named it that way. Because originally when we opened, we had only the classic game back here, but they kind of spilled out in the front area now. <laughs> but, um, of course, the Ms. Pac-Man and Pac-Man necessities here. Oh, yeah. Especially this year with Pac-Man being Pac-Man's 30th birthday. Yeah. We're doing a whole bunch of stuff. Watch us on Facebook and on YouTube. That we'll be announcing all the events. We're going to have various theme days and Pac-Man's birthday party and a bunch of stuff like that. Oh, and you got track and field. Oh, yeah, track I remember, and field, the only game that I let the customers actually beat on without me beating on them. Yeah, I remember I used to uh, I used to put my hands like this back in the days and put like a pencil yeah. and hit this finger so that this finger's hitting. Oh, yeah. or, or, people, or people used to butter the buttons. Um, oh, a whole yeah. bunch of <laughs> <laughs> but I remember that. I remember the, pet, the pencil technique and here's uh, Space Invaders, huh? Yes, yeah, Space Invaders Deluxe that actually is it's actually a black and white game it's the color is actually a screen overlay yeah. it's on the monitor yeah it's, before they went to color and video games they were experimenting how to turn a black and white game into color yeah it's kind of cool now it's so Michael, your machines are super mint condition like you just like you had them like still like in a closet or something yeah well put a lot of work in them this is a 60 in one machine it has 60 different classic games like Frogger, Galaga, Mappy, Dig Dug, all the Donkey Kong. Wow, this is cool. I like this. Now we just need to add two more buttons and then we set. <laughs> Burger time. Definitely a, a favorite that um, they don't know, never go anywhere because I'll be killed if I'm out of favorite machine. So I've had yeah. it for years. Saxon is a pretty cool game, one of the first three dimensional games. Yeah, I love Saxon. Actually, I got it. I got. I picked up a Coleco just for these classic yeah, games. Yeah, the system was orange. Yeah, first. it was awesome. It was like an extra, like when games were 30 bucks at for Saxon, it was like 40 or 50. Yeah. Division. Kangaroo from Atari. Yeah. This is our other multi Williams machine that has all the Jaws, Defender, Robotron. Yeah, I was playing Mario Bros. in there. I was like, whoa. Yeah, no, the original Mario Bros. <laughs> yeah. And then the Play Choice 10, which has 10 games. They're all classic NES games. Yeah. That even all the codes worked. And I finally got a guy here that knows to tell me the codes to punch out. Wow, that is awesome. I haven't played those in a while. This was another system by Bally Midway called the Sente system. And you can interchange control panels, the marquees, and the ROM cards. And there's probably like a library. I think it was at least a dozen games. Some of them are really hard to come by now, but like this one's going to be changed out to mini golf real soon in the summer. Yeah. And you got the point blank over here. Point blank, too. I came across that and it came to back here, but people love it. Yeah. Kind of, if you don't like all the blood and gore of a shooting game where you're just so repetitive because that's all you had, this is all like weird stuff. You know, some screens where you have to do addition and some racks. Then you got the, 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 the cocktail. Oh, wow. I got these in yesterday. Oh, you got them in yesterday? Oh, yeah, you told me you were working on the space in the uh, asteroids. Yeah, the nice shape. I was happy to come across it. Wow, these are a nice shape. This, this is the man needs a little bit more work. But, um, in a day or so here, we'll have her all up and going. Yeah. I can, uh, I can foresee a tournament on one or both of these games coming up in the next couple weeks. Because <laughs> I've been having a lot of people asking for asteroids. Yeah, this is one of my favorite rooms in uh, in, the, in the Star Wars arcade. Cause this is how my room would look if my wife would have let me. But <laughs> you know how it goes. All right, so let's go to the next room.